first video for Tales of Vesperia. So I'd like to talk a little bit about this game. It originally came out in 2008 for the Xbox 360 and there was a few people who liked the game. I saw the trailers for the game. I didn't want it because it seemed unfinished. Then a year later in Japan, they released a PS3 version that was actually way better than the Xbox 360 version because it utilized the two characters that they completely erased. For some reason, Microsoft made a deal and got this game, but only got it halfway done. It was a bad deal but recently they released it last year it was they released the definitive version which is the version that was released in Japan for the PS3 now this is the best version of the game and I recommend people who watch this video to pick up this game because it's actually a really good story the characters are well written and that's all I gotta say for now so let's Start the game. All right, let's see. So for the configuration, this is the message speed. I suggest everyone puts it at, at once. I'm going to put my difficulty at hard, even though other people can, I don't recommend easy. Most people will breeze through the game. No more I recommend for people who haven't played this type of game before, but I'm going to put it on hard because I know this game. Um, let's see, let me change the volume on this. This is fine. Ah, oh, background music. There we go. Lower that a little bit. Alright, we're done with that. Our world. Terka Lumerays. No one knows how far its lands and oceans stretch. For the people are no match against the hordes of monsters call the earth. Barriers protect the cities in which we live, and we are completely dependent upon them for our survival. These barriers are generated by the Blastia. The Blastia use the primeval power of air that fills the world to provide us with fire, water, and light. They provide us with everything that has made the Empire prosper. Forget the threat of the vicious monsters lying in wait just beyond the barriers. The blessings of the Blastia will bestow ever more prosperity to the world and peace to its people. I don't get it. What could have happened to the barrier in this town? From the Imperial... 
Imperial capital of Zophius, bedrock of peace. We pray, may tranquility bless this world. This is not good! What's with all the yelling, Ted? Look! The Aqua Blasty is broken again! And they just finished fixing it! What's the big deal? Just leave it to the mighty Imperial Knights. That's what they're there for. Huh, the Knights? You know they never come to the lower quarter. What about the heroic Flynn? I already tried to get Flynn. They wouldn't even let me see him. Oh, so I'm Flynn's replacement, huh? Never mind that. Come on! We're short on people. Ted! Ted! You get down here! They need your help, too! I'll... I'll be there in a sec! Yuri, come on already! That's weird. He always comes running whenever there's trouble. This place is gonna become an aquarium soon if this keeps up. And we're back. All right. I have voice acting, so usually I'm quiet during those scenes, which is how I'm going to be through the rest of the game. Um. So back to what I was saying earlier. This and um, a few other characters, but he's the dark hero of the story, which is a twist from... The other games in the series because this this is um a series of games they're all called tales of and they have another part to the name like some have been called tales of Sophonia, tales of the abyss and there's other ones but as i get more and more videos and finish this series i'll do another tale series but the thing is these games they all have interesting story points and well-written characters some of them their art is a little kitty but don't pay attention to that because these games are actually really good and a lot of people miss out on how good these games are and there's a lot to do in them so that's one thing from the item there um is there anything else in this room no so yeah so this is probably my favorite character out of the entire series because as we go on and you see his story you'll see why he he crosses a few lines that really show the 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 blurred lines that the world goes through that people would think oh you know that's not really a hero sometimes heroes have to do the bad things for the world to be safe but anyway, we're not there yet, so we have a skit here. Let's see what First, this is. First, the trouble with the knights yesterday. Now the aqua blast here breaks. Why does stuff like this happen every day in the lower quarter? <clears throat> I know, I know. There's no use whining about it. <clears throat> now this game also has skits, like you just saw, and they're voice acted. 
they, they have the voice actor speak during those skits. Some games they don't. Some games there is no voice acting at all. But this game was probably had the best voice acting out of all of them. Point. And a little tutorial about them. Make sure when you go through this game you collect you go through and step through all of them because there's an achievement for stepping through all of them uh, we don't need to save right now um let's pull up the menu so equipment you have your sword you have your what's in your left hand um your helmet your armor accessories you don't have none right now but Weapons change obviously throughout the game and eventually weapons carry skills that you can level up and equip onto your character. You have your items, apple gels which are your healing items. I'm going through the tutorial of explaining some of these things for people who've never played Tales games but for those who already know, you know what each thing is. These are your magic lens. You need these to scan monsters for your monster book because you get a monster book that you need to collect data on all the monsters in the game. So make sure you have enough of these and scan every monster in the game. Then oh, this is where all your special items go. Now as you can see I have a whole bunch here. These are DLC items I got. I'm not going to use the level boosters, I'm not going to use the glad, which is your money in this game, or the sets right now, the, the camp sets, kits and stuff like that, I'm not going to use that. But what I will do is take the costumes, because the costumes in this game you can get for free now. Back in the Japanese version, to get every costume that they had at the store was a excuse me was hundred and fifty dollars and I was like yeah I'm not spending hundred and fifty dollars for this but for the PS4 it's free so when you pick up the game go to your DLC check it out grab it and now you go to your stats and you have your character's name and then his title now there's games where the titles actually increase your stats but this one not really they're more cosmetic so he has these two that are just names then these are costumes this is a character from another tales game so is this no this one's actually his costume from the movie because there actually is a movie to this game that's a prequel and it explains it goes into the story of him and Flynn and the dog he has his dog he actually got it when it was like one years old or something like that and it was so small and cute but now he looks like a wolf and this is another character's outfit this outfit is a uh, original outfit for the game so is this one and this one is another movie costume alright so I think this is the best looking one we have right now I would do the Abyssal Inferno, but uh, I don't want to do it for this playthrough. Um, we don't have no attachments. Alright, that's it for now. Let's go. treasure down there? Yeah, but you're late, so I'm not sharing. <laughs> How nice. Hey, it's sink or swim in this world. Looks like that blue-blooded mage we hired to fix the blast deal left the job half done. Glad you can find the time to stop by, Yuri. Take it easy with the water sports, old man. You're not getting any younger. You're up next! I'm not afraid of a little water, I hope. Yikes. Come on now, put your backs into it! Hey! Oh! Hey! Things is really going at it. 
He feels responsible. He's the one who pushed the people to get the money together for the repairs. And now he's the one who's all wet. It's not Hanks' fault that mage did a two-bed repair job, though. That's true. He even parted with his wife's keep. core anywhere? You know, that shiny piece in the center? Huh? Is it gone? Yeah, the Blastia won't work with the core missing. That aristocrat who came to do the repairs was the last person to touch the Blastia, right? That's right, Mr. Mordio. And he lives in the royal quarter? Yeah, so? Forget about that, Yuri. Give us a hand here. Sorry, Hanks. I just remembered an errand I've got to run. Hey, wait just a minute! You're not seriously thinking of going to Mr. Mario's place, are you? The royal quarter? Me? I wouldn't be caught dead going to a place like that. It gives me the creeps. Damn it, Yuri! Just because you can do a few tricks with that bony blast you, you think you're invincible. Here's hoping he doesn't do anything crazy. He always seems to cause problems when the lower quarter's involved. Even the knights have started keeping an eye on him. Well, it's just an average day for Yuri. I'm sure he'll be fine. <laughs> so, Yuri's the type that doesn't like people stepping on other people. And, um, as you can see, he cares a lot about the people down here. As a matter of fact, Yuri used to be a knight. And Rapide used to be a guard dog for the knights. With his father or mother, I'm not sure if it was his father or his mother. But they were also special unit in the night, along with Flynn. Who we'll meet in the story eventually. So here goes a store. Which is good, because you need to buy a lot of these. Make sure you always have it maxed out. Because like I said, you need to examine every monster in the game. Let me get some apple gels. Make sure I don't lose this fight that's coming up. Mm, is there anything else here? I have nothing so oh. um going this way you there you there are you aware of the serious events going on in the world over here right here I'm the wonder reporter bringing you the articles about what matters most every day do you read the newspaper in the morning? Cup of coffee? Donut? What? You don't? That just won't do. What epic thing has transpired today? You'll never believe it. You can read it whenever, wherever, and with no effort at all. Yes, it's the Wonder Log. Put it to good use. And by the way, let's let the fact that I'm in the wall be our little secret, okay? Well then, farewell! Huh? So now there's a character that just exists in the wall. 
Now you're gonna run into him like three times in this game. And you need to make sure that you run into him each time to get certain items that are rare items. Um gave us the wonder log. Oh, there's nothing to look at in it. Alright. Um Alright, let's move on. Hey, you hear about the Blastia in the lower quarter? Yes, I heard something about it breaking and them collecting money to fix it. That's right. I hear that lot went so far as to sell their treasures to save up the money. Treasures, sir? <laughs> Worthless junk. Nothing more. They wouldn't have gotten more than one gold for them. Not even one gold? I can't imagine what sort of treasures those would have to be. I'd like to have a look myself. I'm telling you, nothing but junk. <laughs> Listen to those guys. Poor Hanks. Can't really argue with them about the junk thing, though. What the? Who's there? <laughs> If you can't understand the value of junk, you're worth less than junk yourself. Repeat, can you find the trail? So they've been taking Blastia cores from here too. Looks like somebody's got some sticky fingers. That's the Royal Quarter for you. A few Blastia cores go missing, and no one even makes a fuss. When just one is enough to throw the lower quarter into chaos. If they got cores to spare, they could stand to give us some. Found it! Looks like the nobles are living the sweet life as usual. Oh. The lower quarter is right there. They still don't give a damn. It's not their loss, so what do they care? They should act, you know, noble. Not just dress nice and hide in their mansions. <laughs> so, Yuri one hit KO'd those knights with rocks, and we get here to find out that this person has been stealing Blastia from everywhere. Then the rich people here don't even notice it. It's like, really? And it's like right there. So that means they just did not care. But truthfully, that's how a lot of rich people are in real life. If it's not something that has to do with them, they don't care. So this is where he lives. Doesn't seem like there's anyone around. I wonder if there's any other way in. Yeah, these games, these tales games tend to cover a lot of topics like the main ones religion, the hierarchy, and, um, the rich and the poor thing you know even racism in their own way because they deal with um elves and half elves and whatnot but this is i don't think there's half elves in this game i think it's just all normal people oh is it open can i I know Mordio is hiding here somewhere. Alright, let's check around for items. There goes some gold. Because that's how you say it. I said it wrong earlier.
that must be. Found him. You were Mordio, right? Good boy. What the? The Blastia core is gone. Let's go and get that core back. And give that mage a whooping while we're at it. Oof. All right, let's go outside. There's nothing else in here. Um. Yuri! So it is you who are the cause of all this commotion! I know he's poor. I'll be right back, guys. Give me one second. House? My my, how the mighty have fallen. Sorry, that was my door. Just what I needed. Tweedle A and Tweedle B. Just what is a Tweedle anyway? There's no hope of escape. We've got you surrounded. Does it look like I'm trying to escape? See, it's stuff like that that keeps you guys from getting promoted. You did not just say that! I say, you take that back! Enough beating around the bush, I guess. Stand back, Otacor! I'll handle this! In the name of the Imperial Knights! I say, I shall be the one to defend the good name of the Imperial Knights! Peons, I say, should stand back! You're the peon! No, no, I say! I am your superior! I appreciate the sentiment, guys, but let's cut the catfight and get on with it. All right, so they're giving the tutorial on the battle system. Front and back is the left analog stick. The jump up is square, and the up on the analog stick. And to change what an enemy you target, you use R1 and the L analog stick. this move towards enemies then to move freely around the field till you reach the barrier because there's a barrier on the field it's this blue line but you can move around the entire field with L2 and the L analog stick hey let's go you ready I am your superior nay focus you are, I say, clearly my subordinate. I guess I just gotta whack these guys a little. Now for your attack is O. You have a three hit combo. And you can do it while moving freely. But as you get further and further into the game, your combo chain increases. And 
and you also can switch targets while running like that. Ow! There, how'd that make you feel? How dare you! Hitting someone in the middle of an argument is hardly proper manners! Didn't you hear me when I said, you ready? Or were you not listening? Damn it! Oh, oh brother. Uh, you... stop right there! Does it look like I'm running? <laughs> you! Be quiet! Oops, time for a little defense. Square to guard against attacks. He blocked my attack. I say sonic thrust. Whoa, come on, give me a break. Ooh, I say how dare you block my art. Man, you need to calm down. And if you can use strike arts here, then I can too. So this is your first skill, Azure Edge. Let's try that again. This next one's gonna hurt. So you can chain them into a combo like this. Arts are used with the X button. Ah, oh, you're not giving up already, are you? Uh, I say, Imperial Knights never give up. You have yet to see our true power. This next time's for real, guys. That's no, my, my line, line, I say. <laughs> Let's use our lenses on them. Yeah, every time you use an item, it has a timer until you can use another one. And to pull up your item menu is the triangle button. hard mode. They hit a little harder. You're dead. Forgot they have so much health. Yeesh. You're dead. I'm about to spam my Azure Edge on them because I forgot that this game, they um, the hard mode has a lot of spongy enemies. So used to playing this game with a party. Guess I underestimated these guys. Looks like I won't be catching up with that carriage anytime soon. Maybe I should have used those buff items. But anyway, it's fine, whatever. That that won't How always be the case. typical of this swan brigade. They can't even manage to capture a single lowlife. Captain Cumor, I say our apologies for this unsightly display. I'm afraid the Imperial Knights have no use for you, lowborn scum. 
Uh, please, don't let Sir Schwann know about this, sir. I can't believe our taxes go to paying these guys. There he is. I say, that tops it all. Abandoned by his faithful pooch. <laughs> well, well, you've had a busy day, haven't you, Mr. Yuri Lowell? I'm rather busy myself, but I suppose I can afford to play with you for a while. Gentlemen! It's rats like you that make Flynn's job so difficult. Flynn? A little suffering is just what that upstart lieutenant needs. When you've finished with him, throw him in the prison as usual. Ten days or so ought to teach him a lesson. So like I was saying, the thief made off with a priceless treasure from that noble's mansion. I know, I know, then he was caught and the loot was returned, right? No, see, that's just nobility trying to keep things quiet. The treasure in the mansion right now is a fake. You're pulling my leg. Hey, you didn't hear it from me, Bob. The Dark Wings are going nuts looking for the hideout. You mean the Thieves' Guild? <clears throat> That's enough out of you. Almost mealtime. Hey, neighbor. You're awake, right? You gotta be getting tired from keeping so quiet. You think that little story up all by yourself, old man? You must have plenty of time on your hands. Old man? Now you've gone and hurt this old man's feelings. Besides, I didn't make up nothing. I've got eyes and ears the world over digging up information for me. <laughs> sure you do, old man. Hey, I am what I am. Go ahead and ask me something. I'll tell you whatever you want to know. Want to know about the Pirate Guild's sunken treasure? How about the sorcerer who makes his home at the ends of the earth? Or wait, I've got it. I just want to know how to get out of here. Well, I'm not sure what you're in for, but they'll let you out if you keep your trap shut for ten days. The lower quarter will be underwater by then. The lower quarter? Ah, yeah, I heard about that. I wonder how they're all doing right now. Sorry, neighbor. That's one piece of dirt I don't have. And what am I gonna do about that damn Mordio? The Mordio? You mean to say you've got connections to the famed mage from Ospio, the City of Scholars? Well, do you know about him? Oh, -ho! wanna know, huh? I'm afraid that information won't come cheap. The famed mage from Ospio, the City of Scholars, right? I think I got it. Well, wait, that's not it. He's the, uh, the head of the Gourmet Guild. No, wait, it's the, uh, I mean... Out. Oh well, just when things were getting good. Hurry up. What is Commandant Alexei doing here? Just who are you, anyway? What does the head of the knights want with you? Beneath the statue of the goddess. What are you doing? I said hurry up. All right, easy. I'm coming. I did say I was looking for a way out of here. <laughs> Back again. 
Man, I was just in here last month for fighting some knights collecting taxes. I guess I get free meals out of it, if you can call it food. Damn, Cumor has made this way more complicated than it needed to be. Well, as you can see, Yuri goes to jail. A lot. Would you look at that? It opened. Ever vigilant as usual. With the way he's sleeping, it'll be a while before anyone notices I'm gone. If I come back before morning, I'll never be wiser to my little jailbreak. I think I can check on the lower quarter and make it back by morning. It'll probably be good to try that statue of the goddess, too. Yeah, Yuri tends to fight a lot of knights. Because they're usually smug and arrogant. Like the ones guarding the noble quarter. Let's check these cells, make sure there's nothing in them. Second, guys. Sorry about that. Um, let's see. He's sleeping over here. He's supposed to be guarding the door. Um, got my belongings. Yeah, I forgot. I'm gonna use one. So now I'm level 15. I won't have to grind for a little while either. Who's there? Ah, they spotted me. Let's get this over with. How's this? Distraction! Cool. You like that? How's this? Take this! I'm learning a whole bunch of arts at once. Hurt. You can't win. This'll hurt. How's this? This'll hurt. Let's get you out. like that? He's dead. This'll hurt. How's this? Get out of here. That was easy. grade that I get 30 yeah make sure when you play this game you pay attention to your grade because you need that to buy things at the end of the game to because you need to play this game more than once take a load off for a while my rap sheet is long enough as it is but guess I don't have much choice but to fight if they discover me I need to be wary of these guys on patrol There's nothing in here. Guess we can do this. You can't win. How could this? That was easy. And you know, I forgot something else too. And I keep running into enemies and forgetting to lunge them. But good thing there's a Let's lot of them in here. Let's get this over with. You like that? That was easy. Right. 
um, something in this box, holy bottle. What that does is it makes an aura around you of holy light that keeps enemies away from you for a little while. And as you can see, there's a lot of little items and little crevices. Because this game has treasure chests like these, but it also has items hidden along those little crevices. Go to cape. I can equip that. And boosted my some of my stats. Um, what else did I get? A life bottle. Which is not important right now, but when you start having party members and characters die, this is what you use to bring them back. It gives them 30% of their max HP and 15% of their max TP. Which is your technique points. Because instead of using magic points, they change the technique for some reason. But either way, it gets the job this. done. That was easy. sit here why don't we just go back I can't go back now this is for your own good, miss. You know that. As for the incident, we assume full responsibility and will inform the lieutenant ourselves. How can you say that when you haven't done anything to help me? Please, don't come any closer. Now, now, why don't you put that down? You'll only end up hurting yourself. I know how to use a sword. I'm afraid you leave us no choice. I was hoping it wouldn't come to this. Hey, there she is! This way! Please, you've got to let me go! I have to warn Flynn! Did she say Flynn? Hey! Flynn, you came to help me? Who, who are <laughs> you? Identify yourself. Man, just when I thought I was being sneaky, things have to go to hell. Careful, I think he's got a blast here. It shouldn't be a problem if we take him together. Oh, really? We'll see about that. This will hurt. 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 Man, is this what knights do now? Don't they teach these guys manners in night school anymore? Are you trying to kill me? Well, you don't belong in the castle, right? No, and I'll take it as a compliment that you can tell that by looking at me. Yuri Lol! Where are you? You foul fugitive! I say, we know you're trying to make your escape! Oh, please, not them again. I guess there's no point in going back to the prison cell now. Louder, fools. Say it like you mean it. Lieutenant LeBlanc, your voice is too loud. My ears. Yuri Lowell? You're one of Flynn's friends, aren't you? Yeah. Why? 
And you used to belong to the Imperial Knights. Just for three short months. You hear that from Flynn? Yes. Huh. Guess he managed to find someone at the castle he could talk to after all. Yuri, I need to talk to Flynn. Hold on just a second. Who are you supposed to be, anyway? I can tell you know Flynn, but why are you being chased by the Knights? Over here! Listen, I want to hear the whole story, but we can't really afford to stand around and chat. First things first, let's get to Flynn's place. Want me to lead the way? Uh, yes. Let's go. So, yes. The, the mysterious girl was about to clonk us over the head with a vase. Then she was like, yeah, I don't know you, so I'm going to hit you with this. Yuri's just like, yeah, thanks. Mmm, something smells tasty. Oh, you're right. What could it be? Oh, yeah. Isn't the night's dining hall around here? Let's fight him first before we go in there. Guess we can do this. Slung it's him, too. I forgot about him. You want revenge? Bring. All right, let's go in here. There's an item here. Uh, I don't think there's anything else in this room besides the food. Yep. And early game when you play on normal it's good to grind here because you can eat this anytime you want and gain all your stuff your health and TP back so let's go and as you can see the enemies respawn I'm not gonna fight him again guess we can do this you like that? Yeah, easy win. Right, I need to change up my skills since now I have no skills. Since I cheated. But that's besides the point. Anyway. Uh, Azure Edge, Cerberus Strike, Fang Strike, Wolf Strike, Destruction Field. I like Destruction Field. Um, Cerberus Strike strike so as you see you can combinate the arts in your arts menu so without moving the anal the left analog stick you press X you get destruction field or whatever skill you put in the first slot then you can combo it by next doing X and up X and down then side to side then these are the shortcuts which you can use the, the right analog stick but I'm not gonna do that I usually don't really use the R analog stick I thought I could sneak faster guess we can do this destruction you like yeah click this button it doesn't do nothing right now but you'll see later what it does there's nothing in here there's a chest right there oh man all right all right 
Yuri's like, I've had enough of fighting these knights already. Another life bottle. Alright, and this is an apple gel. Touch the save point. So, I think this is a good place to leave it for today. I'm gonna try and see if I can make a video tomorrow. But, yeah, if you like the video, like, comment, share, and subscribe. This is Azure Edge Media signing out. See you guys later.